Yo, what's going on? Sexy Sam on Discord. Today we're doing a ranked 1v1, and I am playing Gilgamesh right now. It's tryhard Thursday, which means we are tryharding on Thursday. And also, I can't get my fucking uh, my audio up. There we go. Um so we're gonna probably be playing some Gilga, and then I wanna play a Freya because I want to try out the rejuvenating heart. And I'm going to go Transcendence here. I'm not going to go Golden Blade. The reason I'm not going to go Golden Blade is because I'm fighting Cupid. And Cupid blows at... No, I mean, he's not, he doesn't blow in general. Well, he might blow in general. I don't know. But he doesn't blow in Smite. Because... Um, <laughs> no, he blows in Smite. Literally because his clear sucks. Well, actually, with Golden Shard, it might be okay. Hmm. Maybe I do need Golden Blade. No, my clear is definitely better than his, right? My clear is for sure better than his. And it shouldn't even be close. Go ahead. Show up. Go ahead, show up. Where'd he go? Oh, there he is. Why did it take him so long to clear that? I'm gonna full commit. I'm full committing. I'm full committing. I'm full committing. I'm full committing. Nice. It's not bad at all, mate. Oh. He's a scaredy boy, scaredy boy. Alright, his dash is down. He just dies here. Oh, he's beads. Okay, he lives here. Alt for beads, I'll take it. And I'm level 5, so I'll grab this. What is it? Druid stone. Okay. I guess I could turn that into Arc Druid, or I could just sell it for a faster transcendence. Either way, they're both good. Uh, kick him in the head. I missed. Is that a stun? Get away from my minions so it doesn't clear my minions. All right. And now we just get the XP camp. I'm really far ahead already. He is so passive. He plays so scared. He's playing so scared. There's no sense in selling Druid Stone. It does give me 15 protection and 50 health right now. I'm only going to sell it when I actually need the gold from it for an item. Because it does give me a little bit of tankiness. So, it's worth holding on to. At least for a little while. I'm going to grab Rock. You think you can hurt me? That's that Druid Stone in action, baby. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> I just let him beat on me for so long. And then he got clappied. There's literally nothing up on the map right now. I am just going to sell this now because I can get... Um... Oh, you know what? I kind of just want to go Blackthorn Hammer. Blackthorn Hammer got buffed. Blackthorn Hammer got buffed this patch. So it got buffed uh, two days ago. And it now has 300 HP on it. And it's only 2200 gold. So that's it's a very, very strong early game item. Um, and obviously we're still early game. I mean, we're three minutes in, right? I'm going to take his blue buff instead of doing mine. Oh, that's a cool icon. I never noticed that before. I'm going to do his blue buff first. Thank you. I probably could have just not picked up that blue, to be honest. You know what? If I go and do my blue right now, he gets, he gets the scepter and I'm not willing. I'm not willing to sack scepter. All right, he missed alt. All right, we missed. He's got no alt. We have scepter. I'm kicking you into the wall. And then I'm owning you. Nice. Kicked into the wall and owned. 
We're just going to get minis here. Because he's going to go to wave. And I want to ult him. Ooh. Let's go, dude. If you make a little grunting noise whenever you're going for the last hit, it almost always works. So that's a little tip I can give you from a from a GM to potentially non-GM level players. If you make a grunting noise when you're actually going for the last hit, it does increase the damage of your last hit, which is important. Also, um, there's a subscription service to high res. If you go to highres.com and then you do slash Sam the dude slash subscription, uh, you can actually pay. I think it's, I pay, I think I pay like $2,600 a month. Um, and they give you legal cheat codes. So I actually do 85% more damage than normal players. Um, you know, so if you're one of those, like one of those oilers, you can just do that. So it makes it makes me just a little bit stronger. I do 85% more damage. Like I think the package I pay for is 85% more damage, 30% more protections, 10% mitigation uh permanently on my account. Uh obviously that comes with, you know, the basics of not being able to be banned and um you know, like always getting GM whenever I want it and things like that, but yeah. That's a, a, sub, a, a subscription service you can go pay for. You don't hurt me, gamer. Cash into it, I dare you. <laughs> okay. All right. I kind of just want to go do Bull Demon, to be honest. Oh, I got, I got Genshi's guard for killing him just now. Not the whole item, that'd be busted. Watch this, I'm gonna kick him into his Phoenix. Not today. <laughs> oh, you dashed, gamer. That's a mistake. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> nice. I got his ass. <laughs> Let's go, dude. Let's go, dude. It's the grunting. It's the grunting. Yo, he got Griffin Wing Oboe. This guy's an attack speed fiend. Oh, I gave him his blue buff by trading with him. Dang it, man. Whatever. Whatever, it's fine. Okay, I'm stunned. I do so much fucking damage. Do you have beads, by the way? Oh, you do have beads. Okay. You do have beads. I'll grab this, and then I'll grab red buff. I can actually utilize red buff now. I really feel like this game... Is already over. I have a really, really hard time believing two thousand gold down that and four levels down that I'm ever dead here. Case in point, I guess. Literally just walked at him. Get the life steal from my my three. And then we'll clear the wave and then we will get the blue buff. Hello, demon. Alright, he has no beads, so this should kill him. Nice. Um, I don't think I do enough damage for this, do I? I might. I actually might. Old. I might get clapped. Oh no! E Ow! Ow! Nice, I did it. Nope, not today. Oh man! You think he'll like? You think he'll run at me? 
he's not running at me bro i had 100 health and he went and backed this guy's taking no chances which i respect honestly i respect that he said you know what i'm down three levels i'm not gonna chase i'm not gonna be greedy i will say you definitely need to be greedy in this scenario <laughs> like i respect the the restraint but it is a negative in this match hold on and we jump but i'm pretty sure with hydras i might be able to one hit him well it's not one hit it but like i could one combo him with like five xc or five uh auto attacks in between maybe like jump on him auto attack one auto attack stun auto attack boom you dash i slow i kick you into the wall wait why is my two on cooldown all right that's some decent damage you're gonna dash it on me i'm 500 health oh i'm so weak and fragile oh oh i'm so weak and fragile i would hate it if a cupid potentially dashed in and murdered me oh that would suck so much i'm so weak oh ah fight me nice he paused i don't think that he's very happy about that i feel like maybe the mental of this man has been destroyed or or there is there is an or or he's a fan of mine and he wants to message me before the game ends which that does happen sometimes so we'll see which one it is if he full pauses it's toxic because if you full pause right before you lose obviously it's just because you want to be annoying to the winner but uh we'll just see what happens i guess i'm yapping i'm sitting here just yapping yeah he is 1400 mmr <laughs> um but it's also 7 a.m so it makes sense it does it makes sense oh pause is ended all right i do the leap and the one all right i cannot do that ow i actually don't know if i can end here all this rage just because didn't salute the incredible sam rage i have no rage gamer gg gamer i have no rage all right that's game one of try Hard thursday i will see you guys in game two thanks for watching yo what's going on boys game two and i passed all my bands because i'm try hard and my brain sells out and um i'm playing on her versus kuzenbo kuzenbo does slap oh this guy's this guy's really good i think i fought this guy a few times i think i fought this guy like three or four times and every single time he surprised me with how fucking good he is I'm pretty sure. But then again, like technically speaking, the 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 name that's just four boxes, it could be I mean it could be a lot of things, I guess. So like there's probably like 50,000 different people this could be. Because the only like boxes show up if it's not a English character, by the way, like if it's a <clears throat> a character in a different language that doesn't have like the English alphabet in it, then it's just boxes. So it could be anyone. So maybe it's a different person than I'm thinking of. But the person I'm thinking of actually rolled my shit like two games in a row, and then I beat him like six games in a row. But he did own me. So we'll see. We'll see. Maybe I get handed here. I wouldn't put it past me. I'm great at losing. All 
right obviously he out cleared me because he, he can triple bounce hello i missed one of those games huh you don't play on her i'm hyping you up god this guy thinks he's good oh that's the cupid from last game um when i said gg gamer and he said i don't care and then after he full paused and he's very angry and then he should talk to me for a while so in case you're wondering what that's about now you know um i could just jump pillar stun kill i don't have beads though so if i jump and he grabs me i die he doesn't have blink which is what i just checked for because i walk up the tower and he has blink and he just blink freeze me i'm gonna die i mean honestly fuck it just, this is fine i only take one tower shot here which is a-okay for me perfect perfect little pillar so he couldn't move and then a little little damage i don't have respect for arrogant players even if it's one of the best ones and you are but your attitudes are in from an asshole stop talking to me this guy gets beaten i am extremely nice to him by the way i said don't worry next game you got it cue again and then he literally just he just calls me arrogant and an asshole for like at, at this point like five minutes crazy behavior actual psychotic behavior but you know what it's dual that's what you get when you play dual I don't think that you can kill me here unless you push me into my minion wave then I will die probably nope I'm alive he's just gonna heal his tower up probably I can't really do much about it I'm just gonna auto tower I guess but he has mannequins so all this damage is probably for not it's not gonna do anything is my guess all right this blue is still down oh he might be flanking me to push me to oh he's not okay okay i'm actually cheating i missed a single auto attack didn't miss my two didn't miss any of my spears for my alt i'm actually cheating That was, that was, that was pretty good. <laughs> Holy crap, dude. That was actually crazy good. I'm not very proud of myself often in Smite, but God damn, that was a good, that was a good sequence of gaming. Uh, let's just go, let's go Crimson Claws because I don't want to stack. I don't want to stack, so we'll just Crimson Claw it. <clears throat> Close your eyes. Dude, that song is so good. We gaming tonight, right? Uh, I don't know if we're going to be doing scrims tonight because I don't think my team can do it tonight, Dark. Um, If those of you who have not been to the subathon yet, please come by i'd love to have you uh there's a content creator cup going on in march that i'm going to be a part of where basically a bunch of content creators are making teams and then going against other content creators and their teams in conquest and there's going to be like a LAN event and everything like that and i'm going to be playing in it my team is consisted of i mean one pro player and four uh gm conquest players me included Excuse me. It is Kona. Ugh. Kona, King Oceans, Venenu, um, Dest, and me. All right. Well, GG. Game two. I guess I will see you guys on game three. Yo, what's going on, boys? Game number three. I passed on my bands again. I'm playing Freya. This Freya is OP. Hoy is also OP. So this will be a fun game to watch. 
I'm not really sure uh, who's going to catch the dub ski here. This guy's name is Giannis Snipes. His early game is probably better than mine, but my late game is by far better than his. So I'm not really sure who catches the dub. Also, uh, instead of... Oh, man. Golden Shard is so good, though. I really... Like, I could go Wing Shard and go for the super early first blood. But I'm going to go for the more consistent play of Golden Shard here. Man. But the, oh, Wing Shard is so strong. So, the, if you don't know... When, the way you played Freya, like, before with the other shards... Um, when Golden Shard didn't exist, basically... And instead there was recipes and like you got bow and all that shit. Uh, you would just go wing shard and horrific. And then the second they show up, you just horrific and wing shard two one, and then completely obliterate them. And they almost always die. Uh, but, but is invading a Hawaii dumb as shit. Cause I feel like it's dumb as shit. I'm going to do it anyways, <laughs> but I feel like it's dumb as shit. Oh, he's definitely setting up his bounce right now. Alright, his jump is down, so he could die here, I think. Yep. Yep, his jump is down. He did get the blue buff because I autoed it one too many times. But, uh, that's fine. I'll take I'll take a kill. I also popped both health potions, but he never hit me. I took zero damage in that entire engagement. He could get red buff here. I guess. I mean, I went to blue because I needed it. He is doing red buff, actually. I wonder if he did the whole buff or if he just did minis because. Oh, he didn't do any. He was just hanging. He was vibing. Okay. Maybe he got scared. He got scared that I was going to corner him. Was good gamer? Not today. That's a jump. I feel like... I shouldn't be scared because he can't triple bounce it unless he goes super out of position. With like the red buff. And if he goes super out of position, I just kill him. You're dead, by the way. I'm I'm dead, by the way. Wait, you're dead, by the way? I'm dead, by the way. Damn it. Oh, he's staying. He's staying. I will say Golden Shard makes Freya's 2 seem like really good clear, actually. Is Freya's 2 normally kind of stinky? You got to use it a couple times to clear really anything of value. But Golden Shard does feel really good. Like the fact that you can basically clear the whole wave this early on with no items. That does feel good. I'm going to go Bancroft's here. Oh, that's a proximity ward, not a multi-pot. Damn it, dude. Whatever. I'm going to slow him. I'm going to slow him with the proximity ward. Check it. Ouch. What the fuck? Owned. Oh. He just jumped it. Well, that is a tragic waste of 75 gold. Ow. Hello. Boop, 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 boop. I'm coming. All right. I want to fight you. Actually, I'm cool if you don't want to fight because blue buff is up and I'm down to take this. You want to fight me now? Okay. Well, you missed. How he oh, he got it with golden charge, brother. He's going to triple bounce me here. Never mind. I have no mana. I'm just going to sit here and punch him in the head. I'm mana-less.
I feel like he might come and own me real quick. Man, he seems very scared of me. I literally have no mana at all. I'm just auto attacking. Um, I'll level up the alt. Sure. Let's get this blue buff. Yeah, that that I had a yeah, I had a yippee clip. <laughs> so yesterday, yesterday I was you know solo queue at conquest as one does during a subathon when they have no friends. I don't want to die, so I'm just gonna I'm gonna whoop you if that's cool. Um, I was so lucky in Conquest, and I've got Poo Poo McGillicuddy teammates like a hundred times in a row. I lost 300 MMR, and my mental was shot, and I went full psychotic mode and screamed yippee while shaking my head so hard my headphones fell off and my desk shook. <laughs> maybe I'll Maybe I'll edit that clip into this video right now, just for fun. Actually, I don't know. There's probably music playing in the back of that clip, but if there's not, then I'll then I'll edit it in. Hello. Kablam! Kapow! Kadoosh! Kaboosh! Kablam! Skadam! Wow! Pow! Woo! 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 Nice. Like I said in game one, sound effects make you do way more damage. Now, do I go for the corner on him? I definitely can. Oh my god, he's going crit chance. Second item, bro. Second item, crit chance is criminal against Freya. I'm gonna blast your shit, gamer. I missed all my. I'm missing all my auto attacks. Now I'm gonna blast your shit. Okay, hold on. I'm gonna stay in. Oh, oh nice. I can just just stroll on through. Nice. Oh, that's a surrender. All right. Well, I guess I will see you guys in game number four. Only 36 minutes into the game or into the recording. Uh, probably for you guys, it's more like 30 minutes. Yo, what up, gamers? More past bands and OP gods. Try our Thursday commences. We are playing Bastet now. I have played Bastet on her Freya. And who is my other god? Oh, no, this is game four. That's all I've played so far. I'm pretty sure. Oh, no, and I play Gilgamesh. This is game five. Holy crap. We're blasting through video games right now, dude. We are blasting through video games. Have we had three five-minute surrenders in a row back to back to back? That's insane. All right, Tiamat is tanky, but it shouldn't be that much of an issue. I'm going to go meditation because I'm going to go... Once I finish probably transcendence, maybe transcendence plus tier two defense here. Um, or I'll go like Lifesteal Jotuns, whichever one. I'm going to go like either Soul Eater or Lifesteal Jotuns. I haven't decided yet though, which is why I'm going Transcendence now. Um, but after probably my healing item, I'm going to upgrade Med fully and get that, uh, get that cooldown reduction going. And then I should be able to just like full combo him really easily. Hello. I'm pretty sure I own you if you try to invade me. Like you, you'll you get my buff, obviously, your Tiamat, but I'll kill you. So, I think... I think it's okay. Oh, he's not invading me. His gold went up. He already ate his buff. Holy shit. My dude is gaming gamerly. Wait, why would you come to me instead of the wave? If you got a wave there, you're already done clearing, and then you have insane pressure. I mean, not that you're not already done clearing now, I guess. Maybe he wanted to eat my buff, too. Maybe he thought my, my clear was bad. Alright, I'm definitely owning. I'm out-pressuring. Also, if because he ate his blue buff, he can, he can eat the red buff also, but what he can't do is actually utilize the red buff if he eats it. You can't pick it up because you're only allowed to eat one buff. 
I need to root with my cat. Uh, it's a kill if I landed the root, but I uh, I suck. So, unlucky. Is he actually backing or is he fake backing? Let me keep my eye on him. He is actually backing, so I can full commit. And then... I could probably alt him. But I don't think I kill without Transcendence and Red Buff. Like, he's really tanky. And he's got to leap out. Like, alting him maybe leads to a kill if he's, like, low. I don't know. I'm just going to go for the... Uh, I'm just going to go for the Transcendence now. He's going to go Tablet. Because uh, Tiamat's really good with Tablet because she can drop that Tornado or she can use her two in um, in like Mage Stance and not Combat Stance and just completely obliterate. Ow. I do want this. I feel like I won't be able to get it. I feel like there's going to be a fight that breaks out here. Never mind, he just let me have it. Big clear. All root. Oh, jump in. Okay. I'm surprised no alt there. Probably because Okay, he doesn't want me to alt him, I assume. Um Good Aegis, but not good enough. That was, that Aegis was really good because it actually stopped most of my two on him. It probably would have been more beneficial to actually no that was probably the best agency could have done i was gonna say that it would have been more beneficial to ages the initial damage of the alt but it only did 100 so my two is probably more damage in general yeah i mean it my two just so much damage holy shit he's coming for his blue i am down to fight to the death on this blue he's not tanky right now so he might die to that did not die to that, but I do get the blue buff. He doesn't have his three up, so I'm not scared of him jumping over the wall and eating the buff. He has to actually walk around the corner and steal the buff with an ability if he wants to take it, which obviously I'm not going to let him do. Um, So we're in a really good spot here. We got out of the six buffs on the map, we've gotten five of them at this point. Technically, there's only been five that spawned so far because we don't know what's going to happen with that next red, but... Out of the five buffs that have spawned on the map, I've gotten four of them, which I'm very happy about. I have meditation. I'm just going to pop it here. And I think I can fight here. Oh, uh, he's got a horn shard. Maybe I just run. Horn shard is a little scary on the Diamat. If you hit me, you die, right? Yeah. Not exactly sure what that was for. Maybe he thought that I would die to it. I will die to this buff though, for sure. Oh, never mind. My passive is OP as hell. I forgot about my passive. Bastet's passive is that she gets um. Do I need a new weapon? What is she? She gets life steal and ability life steal. What her passive used to be that she does more damage, and she can see them on the map. It's like a like a ward almost. That's what it used to be, but now it's now it's just like, hey, do more, do more healing. Yeah, he takes so much damage. He should be very scared of me. If I'm him, I'm never contesting this. He's getting poked so hard. Oh, I thought that would hit anyways, dude. All right, fair play. Fair play. Alt down. His jump's down. He's going to have Breastplate, which means he's got some cooldown. He didn't go Tablet, though, so his... I, I don't think he can win. The only way you really win with Tiamat in Duel is by sacking the early game and going Tablet. My 2 does 28 damage. No, that was my 3. That was my... That was my... My kit. My kitty cat. 800 gold for meditation, 600 gold for upgraded Jotuns. So I need 1400 to back. And theoretically, nothing will change when I back. I don't know. Actually, because I'm this far ahead, I don't think I need the meditation cheese. Oh, 
That was good damage. Maybe kill? Big Aegis. Big Aegis. Oh, good juke. Oh, I do think he dies here, though. Yep. Yep. He juked the alt, but uh, with Horn Shard and a few other things, I'm able to just be OP. There's blue buff spawned. I really do want that. I'm actually going to med it for that. And I really hope I can kill it fast enough to jump back over the wall. And I can. Thank God. I'm not going to clear the wave. I'm just going to go straight for blue buff here. If I go for the wave, then he has a chance to just jump in and, and clear my blue. So I have to sack maybe one or two minions worth of XP in order to get my blue buff confirmed. And as you saw, as you saw, he was going for the the, the blue buff there. He's going to probably send that at me. I don't really care if he stops my back because if he dives in here, he will die. Um, and I think he's also very scared to dive in here. Okay. He was blocking my jump back. I guess he still was, or still is blocking my jump back. I can maybe kill though. Oh, okay. I have ult in five seconds. He has no Aegis. Yep, you're dead. Yep, you're dead. If you get a hold of like cooldowns in Smite, you can outplay so many people. Like you don't even need to be that good mechanically. If you just know I have this up and they don't have this up or I have this up and they have this up and you know, you can go through your head of the options of how the fight could play out just because you know what cooldowns they have up. That's like the biggest asset you can bring to a duel. Cause like, no way like most people just back there when he's diving tower trying to get the kill on me they just back because they don't think they can get the kill but if you know like oh he just jumped his jump is a really long cooldown so he's not going to be able to do it again which means i can throw my alt because he doesn't have ages and he doesn't have jump right if you know that that you're safe then um then it's just super easy to to get ready to fight. Also, Cat can tank this for a couple hits for me. I jump back. Um, I want him to ult so he's not CC immune, and then I land my ult. He's got no jump. He's got no Aegis. Okay, I lied. He had Aegis. I guess it just came back up. That Aegis had to have just come out. I think that Aegis came up maybe two or three seconds ago. Because I Aegis... Or I dove him under tower maybe kill i it was kill number three at maybe the seven minute mark and aegis is a three minute cooldown or a two and a half minute cooldown i'm really safe right now i don't know if i can get this blue buff though Are you, do you have your jump up i assume you do right you don't why don't you have your jump I mean, he does have it up. He's just not using it. There we go. I wanted him to use the jump because now he can't eat blue buff. Now he can't yoink it. I can blink on him because he's got no jump. I missed. That is super unlucky. The horrific shard to get jump up was a good play. Not horrific. Uh, the horn shard. It will start with H. Cut me some slack. Um, what's my next item here? Art Seeker is doing almost nothing because I don't have enough power and he doesn't have enough health because it's early on in the game right now. I just bought it because it's an expensive ass item and I could afford to, to get it now and not have to grind to get the money for it later. I want Hydras too. Hello. Um, if I alt, you just jump it, right? Oh, never mind. So you do Aegis it. Oh, he always jukes, right? You know, so here, here's something that 
uh, another thing that you can do to learn how to get good at smite like another tip i have if you can you can learn juking patterns really easy within the first like two or three fights and he always jukes right um when i'm using my ult like every time i'm ulting he's always going this way which is left for me but it's right for him when i'm looking at him um and i thought because he always jukes right maybe he's gonna switch it up and juke left this time so i shot left and he still juke right like it's, i'm such an idiot he's obviously always gonna juke right just throw it right like, like all right i heal a ton so i'm not very scared so you're gonna use your two um i mean I guess I just go bold demon here, right? I have a lot of gold though. If he comes over here, there I just kill him. Cause I have alt up as well. He might be able to steal steal this if he comes over here, but then he dies for it, and I don't know if that's worth it. Okay. Always jukes right, man. Every time. Aegis and beads down. Every time he jukes right. You gotta switch it up, man. You gotta juke left every now and then. Alright. Waiting for the Jotuns to proc so that I get a lot of life seal for my wave clear. And then I guess it's just a free Feeny. I have 4,700 gold. He's going to ult me. It's going to hurt. Ow. Nice. Big life steal. Big life steal from the Yotans there. Uh, you have no relics. You have no jump. I think you're just dead here. Yeah. You're just dead here. All right. Life steal. This should be a win, right? Does that do damage? It does. All right. GG on game number five. And I will see you guys for game number six, I guess. I'll see you game number six. Let's go, dude. Yo, what's up, boys? Welcome back. This guy is an omega gamer he passed his bands i passed my bands literally there are no bands let me see if i can if i can turn this off real quick oh i didn't turn it off in time there are literally no bands in this game mode at all zero bands it's go time baby this guy chose violence for sure for sure he did he said, fuck it. I'm queuing. I'm passing bands and I'm going to shit on him. And then Uller. I was fully expecting an Uller mirror, by the way. And I don't even play Uller that much. I really wanted to get an, an Anubis game for this trial on Thursday. But I've already been recording for an hour and three minutes. So after this game, it'll probably, after cutting out queue times, it'll probably still be an hour video, which is what I shoot for for trial on Thursday. So this will be the last game. Kablamo. Kablamo. Okay. You think he's going to invade me still? He's very tanky, by the way. Um, he's not invading me. Nice. This is really good for me. You cannot tank the whole wave. You're going to get owned. Oh, 
Of course I hit all my autos and missed the one ability I throw. That's such a me thing to do. Holy shit. Alright, I'm just keeping pressure up right now so I can go get red buff. I don't know why. Why'd you kick me there? Um, I think it is good to level your alt, right? Oh, by the way, you can't kick the big minion. You can't kick me, though. Out. I missed! Okay, but you can't fight me, though. Um, what is leveling my ult do? It gives me attack speed, right? It gives me power in the bow stance. Okay. It gives you 20 power? Wait. Physical power while in bow stance, 20. Holy shit. Wait, that's a lot of... That's a lot of power, man. Wait, but it's only giving me 10. Wait. I was lied to. I'll fucking die for this. I'll die for this. I am a scepter deader. I'll die. I don't care. Nice. I killed him and I got the scepter. I don't care if I have to walk back into death to get the scepter. I will do it 10 out of 10 times. Oh, you get half of the benefits of your ult while in the other stance of it. Okay. So 20 power while I'm in... 20 bow power while I'm in axe stance still gives me 10 power. Which is why it looks like I only get 10 power when I switch to bow stance. I get it. Thank you. Thank you for explaining that. Oh gosh. That also means I get 7% life steal by default. I am so bad at video gaming. <laughs> he's he's juking so much. He's juking so much. It's kind of funny. Oh, man. He went to go jump the wall instead of run, run around the wall. I threw the axe to predict the the wall movement. Not the jump movement. Right, but I do get the blue for free. That's pretty nice. And then... uh. I mean, realistically, I don't really see any threat I'm under right now. I think it's just he has to make it to Lake him and one hit me. That's like the current threat that I'm under is not ending fast enough. Which has never been a problem for me in life. So let's get this. And then we'll get red buff. Don't, hey, don't look at me. What was that axe? Oh, that missed. Alright. I don't know why I went for the last hit so hard there. Last hits don't matter anymore. I mean, they give you... You get more gold for last hitting. But it's not like mandatory to stack anymore. You can actually kill me here, by the way, because I'm being so greedy. Oh, never mind. Oh, he jumped and didn't you. Unexplained or unexplainable actions. Uh, I'll wait. I'll wait the 100 gold for this. There's nothing up right now. Uh, there might be XP camps up, but he can get them. I don't mind. I'll wait for the life steal. So leveling my alt again gives me... So if I max my alt at level 20, I get 22.5% life steal in my bow stance for free. And 22 power in my axe stance for free. That's really good. 
Ghoul are all kind of good. Okay. He horrific me, so I'm just going to run away. Waste that horrific if I can. He doesn't really juke at all, so I'm just going to start shooting straight at him. I don't know where he is. All right, let's just cut these down. All right, I'm going to jump the blue buff because I want the blue buff. Um, oh, did he just back? I think he just back. Did he, oh, he, did he just all in me and then back immediately when I jumped over the wall? I think he did. That damage is not very good. I guess he does have a full berserker shield right now, though. Nice. Nice. Nothing like a little Uller W to end the and I was going to say end the stream, but I have another 77 hours for that. But to end the Try Hard Thursday video, because that, you know, that was, a, that was a good little flick at the end there. A little flick axe and then a flick one. Not bad, dude. Not bad. I even auto canceled, even though he was behind the tower, just because it, it was it was muscle memory to auto cancel there. Anyways, GG gamers. I hope you guys enjoyed the uh, the video. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, guys, peace.